All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design, learn accessibility by building a quiz, step 33. So if we click on the radio inputs, we might notice both inputs within the same true false field set can be selected at the same time. All right, yep, just like that. So we're gonna get, pardon me, we're going to group the relevant inputs together such that only one input from a pair can be selected at a time, all right. So for this one, we're gonna to need to go back to registration, uh, the registration form project, cause that's where the info is for this. Uh, let's come over here to 63 and open up the index, come down here. Uh, we're gonna be looking for the business and the personal right here. And so we've already got an idea on ours. We've already got the type. Uh, now we're probably gonna need the name. So let's just take the name right here and we'll change it when we get over there, all right? So right after this uh, true, we'll put this right here. All right. And then we'll do it after the false. And then we'll do it after the true. And then after the false. And then we'll name this something like uh, Q2. Q2. And then we'll call this Q1. 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 All right. Now let's see what happens. Good, 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 good. All right. Let's check it and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 34 and we'll see you next time.